So I'm going to start the uh, disassembly of the quill head. What I've already done is several things. I've taken the uh, <clears throat> scale off right here. There were two screw screws and so the scale has now been removed and the uh, screws were somewhere over there. Here they are. Here's the two screws and I've loosened the uh, lock pin here, or the uh, lock uh, washer and generally I've sort of loosened everything but I haven't disassembled anything. Uh, the only thing I've completely taken out is the uh, is the spindle lock which is right here and that just really unscrewed it just unscrewed right here and then this uh, top part came out and then uh, both of uh, the top and bottom half just uh, popped with a little bit of a pressure that came out the appropriate direction so now we're ready to proceed here yes I'm going to have you do it so what I'm going to do now is to take the uh, uh, slotted screws um, out so I can get to the feed uh, reverse trip plunger uh, right here. So there's this one uh, screw right here that should be just coming out now. Is that out enough? Or, uh, not quite. Let's turn that a few more. I really need a larger screwdriver for this but I've already loosened it. So let's just use the bigger appropriate size screwdriver there we go so that's out and then what I'm going to need to do here is uh, is screw in, let me get this for a minute this uh, feed trip ball lever is down into here and there's um, this uh, female thread that I can screw in a number 440 machine thread into and I should be able to uh, yank it out now. So. Question, how is it going to come out? That's a good question, huh? And just wiggle it, or I'm not sure what I need to do here. So, I'm going to play with that for just a minute. 